guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I thought I would take you along with me on a little bit of a day in the life. The uh, boys, my husband and my son are actually at our lake house for the weekend. So it's just me and the girls and I have a really fun day planned. So the plan is first we're going to go to the mall and do a little bit of shopping, which is always fun. There's a couple of things that I want to pick up. I'm actually um, going through and purging some old makeup. So I'm going to see where I'm at with that and see if there's anything else that I need to kind of refill. And I don't know if I'm going to actually make the purchase yet, but I am hoping to update my bedding. I don't know if you guys ever realize, you can see my bedding behind me and this is blue, yet the walls are like a green and reddish color so it really doesn't match that green other than the uh, tile here on the fireplace is blue so that's kind of how I bring the two together but if you're only seeing that side of the room which you often are especially when I'm filming it's just like the blue bed and I don't know the background just totally doesn't match so I'm hoping to update that with like a more neutral color or maybe bring in like a tone of red or pink I'm not sure yet but that's been on my mind for a while now so I want to take a look around and see if I can find something that's a little bit um, of a better match for my bedroom and then we're going to finally go see the new Disney movie Coco which I have been really wanting to see ever since it came out I think that was like Thanksgiving weekend. So I'm lucky that I can still watch it here at our theater. So I'm hoping that we can kind of squeeze that into the middle of the day. And then we're going to end our day at the Cheesecake Factory, which I'm really excited. We've never gone there before. And they recently opened one up at our mall. So that is the game plan. Not sure if it's all gonna pan out exactly the way that I want it to, if I'm gonna be able to fit it all in. But that is the game plan and we'll see how far we get. So it should be a fun day. It's cold here in New Jersey, but it's really sunny, which is nice. And uh, yeah, so that's the plan. And we are going to head out to the mall. And it's 25 degrees outside on this cold January day. <laughs> Look how pretty these Kate Speed phone cases are. So pretty. would be perfect for the Hamilton show. Let's try it on and say. What do you think? Mediocre at best, right? It's not too long. Yeah. I think the one that would look better on you is that this one. That one's cute on you. You want me to try the blue yes. one next? Yeah. Okay. It looks very I, I, I love it. Well, you would. <laughs> I look too teenagery in this dress. All right. It's pretty, but yeah. You know, it's, time to it's time to grow up. Yeah. So, what do you think, Madison? Grandma likes this one. Good. You like this one? Yeah. Is it Hamilton worthy? It's Hamilton worthy. <laughs> this I'm not sure about. I don't think it's very flattering. I don't know. I like it. I like that it has pockets. And I like the print yeah. on it. Yeah. Let's yeah. see what Grandma thinks. Just see see if she likes it. It's a tie. This one or this one? Comment down below which one you think looks better. <laughs> is that the question of the day? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, there's still a question of the day. Oh, what's that? It's at the end. Oh, sorry. <laughs> 
<laughs> but still comment down below what dress. All right. And no visit to the mall would be complete without Starbucks. <laughs> I don't know what to get. Got a peanut butter cookie and a chai tea latte. And I'm going to try Emily's butter beer. Butter beer? does not taste like a butter beer. Harry Potter. Well, I'm looking for another dress. Looking nice. Vinegar chips. Apple juice. That's good. I love that store. My cookie was good. Aren't they cheap? Next, we're going to Francesca, my favorite store. I love this red dress. It's so pretty. Valentine's Day. to add this to my Halloween collection. I love all this stuff. But this, with the tiara, yeah. So we've had a lot of fun shopping so far today and it's just about dinner time. So I'm actually relocating my car over by the Cheesecake Factory because I'm scared the mall's going to close and we're gonna be like locked in at a certain area and it's gonna be hard to get to my car. So I'm just moving over to park directly in front of the Cheesecake Factory. And um, I'm excited to try it out because we've never been there before. But I am done shopping. I am shopped out. My daughter Emily actually got a dress for a Sweet 16 party. And I um, found some really nice bedding that I liked. I didn't get those dresses that I tried on because I have lots of dresses at home. So I'm sure there's something that I can find. I really didn't need to spend the money on another dress. Um, but yeah, so let's go have dinner because I am starving and I need a little bit of a break but we did have a really great day so far today. It was fun just being with the girls and doing a little shopping and just spending time together. It's all good. Okay, so there is an 80 minute wait for the Cheesecake Factory and we're gonna wait 80 minutes, which meant there was a little bit more shopping. So, well that's not, that's a happy thing. Just look at what you did. What you get? Let's see it. I got this BFF necklace that I'm gonna give to my friend. It's magnetic and like it connects and it makes a heart. And there's two little kitties, there you go. I really like it. their little bows. That's cute. It's his best friend. What else did you get? <laughs> the, these sweat pants. The says Justin. Very nice. Rainbow. Uh huh. The sweat And it says France and it's crossed out and it says sisters. That's really cute. Good job, Madison. Finding Yay. some good sales today. Good work. <laughs> Uh-huh, 
Honey, honey. So it's day two of our girls weekend. Sorry that I cut it short yesterday. The Cheesecake Factory took forever. Um, again, it's like newly opened in our area. So of course, everybody is going there and plus it's the weekend. So it's even all the more crowded. Um, our 80 minute wait actually ended up being in reality a two hour wait. And then our food took forever. There was one thing that I ordered that never even came out and I was just like, forget it. I'm just, I started like picking off of my mom's plate and I was full. Um, I did really want to try the cheesecake and I was excited to try it, but it was mediocre at best. It was still partially frozen. I guess they probably keep them on reserve frozen and then they serve them. So like the thicker part of it was like almost completely frozen. <laughs> so I was so excited to go there and my meal was really good. Like the corn, whatever it was that I got, those like little corn cakes. I can't think of what they're called right now. Tamales, maybe? I don't know, they were amazing. They were really, really good. The sliders that I shared with my mom were delicious. Um, so the food was really good. I think that if I return, it's going to be when things calm down there a little bit and maybe try to go like in the afternoon rather than you know dinner time on the weekend. <laughs> so we got home really late and um, I just put Madison to bed and called it a night. So it's day two. We unfortunately never made it to see Coco yesterday because it just, by the time we were done shopping and then we had the two hour wait to eat and it just took forever and ever. So unfortunately we weren't able to squeeze the movie in but not seeing it is not an option for me. I love Disney movies and there's no way I am going to miss seeing it at the movie theater. So today, just me and Madison are going to go. My mom and Emily um, didn't really want to go yesterday anyway. They weren't into seeing that, but I know Madison is. <laughs> so we are just going to have some breakfast and we're going to go see an early movie. And I'm really excited to check out the new uh, Disney movie. And that's really it for today. The boys are coming home later on tonight. So we're just kind of having a chill morning and um, getting ready to go. And we're just having a quick breakfast before we head out. I actually ran to Dunkin', so I am excited to have this egg and cheese on a croissant. It's like one of my favorite Dunkin' Donuts breakfasts. And I am having a coffee, and then we're going to be ready to go. And since the boys aren't here this morning, we can watch a Cinderella story <laughs> while we're having breakfast. Right, Madison? I love this movie. Hilary Duff. It's a great movie, right? It's our second time watching it this weekend. <laughs> we watched it last night. Yeah. We watched it the other night. Last night we were at the Cheesecake Factory till very late at night. Let's see your justice outfit that you got yesterday. Very cute. You look adorable. You excited to go to the movies? Yeah. Me too. So where I put this box in So we're headed off to go see Coco. I'm excited. I'm so glad I'm finally able to go see it. I've been waiting a really long time. So I hope this is a good movie. I've only heard good things about it and hey, it's Disney. So it's gotta be wonderful, right? I'll let you know how it was. Are you excited to go see Coco? Yeah. Yeah? All right, here we go. Do you think you're gonna like it? Mm -hmm. I think so too. I heard it's sad. I hope I don't cry too much. We should bring tissues. Do we have tissues? Yeah, right there. All right, let's bring them just in but case. Kind of well, we'll make it work. How'd you like the movie? It was amazing. Yeah? Okay. I think Madison had a question of the day for us. Mm-hmm. Okay, go ahead. The question of the day is, if you could be a Disney character, who would you be? Ooh, that's a good one. Who would you be, Madison? I would probably be Belle. 
What? Maybe. That's my choice. <laughs> <laughs> you know I'm being Belle, so you better pick somebody else. Um, pick somebody blonde. <laughs> you can be Belle if you want. We can both be Belle. We'll take turns. We'll be twins. <laughs> we'll be twin Belles? Okay. Okay, guys, so we're home from the Coco movie. I'm sorry if I look all blotchy and red, and I know my eyes are swollen. I was crying so hard after this movie. I don't want to give out any spoilers or anything in case you're going to be seeing the movie, but it was so good. It was just really touching, a great storyline. Um, I don't know, if you guys saw the movie, let me know if your first concern when you got home was if you had enough photographs of everybody that you have loved that has passed on because I'm driving home and I'm like, do I have a picture in my house of this person or that person? Like a serious concern for it? I don't know, maybe that's just me. But if you felt the same thing after you saw this movie, please let me know. <laughs> but anyway, it was uh, really, really great. Of course, all Disney movies are and they all make you cry at some point, right? It's always the way with Disney movies. But um, it was really a great day. We had a fun weekend. The boys are home and uh, back to school tomorrow. I think we're getting more snow. I think the next two days ahead of us, we're going to be having snow here in New Jersey. <laughs> so kind of gearing up for that now. And um, yeah, it was a great weekend. Thanks so much for watching. And I hope that you enjoyed our little girls weekend. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please also subscribe down below and follow me at Jen's Happy Home on Instagram. Take care, bye.